In this guide, I'll show you how to install mods in Minecraft Bedrock Edition. So the first thing you want to do is close out the game and open up Google on your web browser and type in Minecraft Bedrock Edition mods and search. Now there's plenty of websites where you can download these mods, however, I personally like CurseForge, so we're going to select that. Now you should be brought to this page, but if you went directly to CurseForge.com, make sure you don't select Minecraft and rather you go to View All, and then you scroll down and select Minecraft Bedrock. Now Minecraft Bedrock mods also have a different name, they're also called add-ons, so just be wary of that. So what you want to do is go to View All here, and then you'll have a list of all these different popular mods for Bedrock Edition. You can also search for specific mods, and you can also sort by popularity, relevance, latest update, and more. And if you have a look on the left sidebar, you can further customize to your liking. So have a scroll and a look through and see which mods you want. In my example, I'm just going to select this one here. And once you select the mod, you will be given a description as to its compatibility with different plugins, in addition to explaining what it is and fixes and such. So once you're happy with the mods that you like, what you want to do is select files at the top. And then from here, you want to go to filter by and select your game version. If your Minecraft Bedrock Edition is up to date, it's going to be this one. And if you have an older edition, you can select it here. But well, once you select your edition, what you want to do is select the top one. And by the three dots, if you click on it, you want to go to download file. Now, when you do this, you will be brought to a different page where there'll be a countdown. And once the countdown's finished, it should appear in the top right corner and begin to download. And when it's done, you just want to click on it. Now, what this is going to do is automatically open up Minecraft and you just want to wait for it to load. So now that Minecraft started up, we'll see import has started and it'll say it successfully imported the mod that you added. So what you want to do now is go to play on the home menu and we're going to create a new world. And once we're here, what we're going to do is change the game mode to creative. I'm just going to put difficulty on peaceful for now. And on the left side, we're actually going to scroll down and go to experiments. And then you want to scroll down and under add on creators, you want to toggle all these features on. Now it is going to give you a warning that it can cause issues with your game and it's going to automatically turn on cheats. Thus, you're not going to get achievements. But when it comes to running these mods in Bedrock Edition, if you don't have these all toggled on, you can run into compatibility issues, especially if you're running multiple add ons or mods. So once you've done that, you can change any of the other settings you'd like on the left sidebar, and then you just want to click on create. And once you're in game, you'll now have the new Minecraft Bedrock mods in your game. This guide was helpful. Like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one.